What is going on guys? Welcome to the video. And um, wow, we have a lot to talk about today. So let's just, let's begin. We'll start from the coolest thing and we'll just progress down. So one cool thing, um, I guess cool thing for you guys, is we have a new car. So it's not new, it's just new to me. Kind of, sort of, not really. Am I, are you confused yet? This is it, we're in it right now. If you follow me on Instagram, you know what it is. If you don't, I haven't revealed it yet. I've had it for like a month. Um, but that video will be coming after this video, actually. So after this video airs, I will have the reveal of this car out. So if you have any guesses, any educated answers, apparently it's kind of a cool car. Um, definitely a bigger following for it than I originally thought of when I got it. Um, just thought it was going to be, which it still is right now. It's just a good little commuter car for work. Um, but maybe we'll do some stuff to it. Apparently it's, uh, I don't know. We'll find out. I'm not quite sure we're going to do with this thing yet. So we'll figure it out. Which brings me on to the next part is I have a new job. So, which is cool. Um, you know, for you guys that, that care, um, I'm running a swim school in Houston. And, uh, so the only downside of that now is I have to pretty much drive almost to downtown Houston for work. So my old commute, I used to run a restaurant. My old job used to be about 13 minutes from from home and now I'm about roughly an hour depending on traffic so um, so yeah so now we're in the car for a lot longer but I think we're gonna be able to use that to our advantage I'm gonna use it to my advantage so what we're gonna do since I have this newfound drive and this new thing called time now because one of the biggest issues I always run into with filming is time whereas right now me driving home I've got nothing but time so won't be obviously a cool dynamic video of a car review or something you know you know fun but i figured it's a good chance for we us me you all of us to just kind of and her hi we're all just gonna hang out together so here's how we're gonna structure it at the end of this video i've already picked the topic for this video because it's a question i've gotten a little bit so we're i know we're talking about this video this whole and i'll think of a some kind of name for it. Right now it's just talking in the car with Dane while driving home from work in Houston traffic. Wonder if we'll have to condense that down. But uh, what we're gonna do is at the end of this video, I want you to comment a question, a topic, what have you, and this is going to be your guys' video. So if whatever, if you, if there's something on your mind, it can be car related, it can be YouTube related, it can be fitness related, it can be uh, dog related, it can be anything related. Um, if you guys want to talk about it, comment it below, and I will give you guys my opinion on it. Obviously, I have to pick it and make sure that it's okay to talk about on YouTube. But uh, as, as long as it is, I think it would be a fun thing. It would be a way to involve you guys more. You know, this channel is growing kind of quickly, and uh, you know, I, I you know I think of you guys as my little extended car family. So I really want to involve you guys in this channel whenever I have the opportunity to. So I think this is a really cool way to do it. We won't do this video all the time. This will probably be like every week thing, like once a week. Maybe we'll do it on Fridays or whatever day. Um, this one will probably come out on Friday. So let's probably, well, maybe let's plan for Fridays. Um, so yeah, so like I said, once this video is over, comment below uh, what you want next week's video to be about. And that's just what we're gonna do. Okay, ground rules over. You know what we're talking about right now. You seen the thumbnail. If you have kids in the room, you have to make them leave because what I'm about to put on the screen is, well, it's frankly um, a murder of, of a good design. So here it is. I know you guys have seen it. If you haven't, Chevy released last week, um, last week, maybe last week, week before, uh, the design for the 2019 Camaro. And... So, okay, so I've got two trains of thought on this car. Let's go with the negative train first, and then we'll see if I can hopefully redeem it a little bit. So, first things first, this car is horrendously ugly in every sense of the word, from the front. That, I, uh, just, man, I hate being mean to a car, and I hate being mean to a car, because you know some designer, Ted, that's his name, just because I like how I met your mother. You know Ted poured his heart out into the front of that Camaro, and just tried to make it the coolest thing he could. And it's, 
anything but cool. That is one of the ugliest front ends I've ever seen in my car, which is really sad because I really like the 6th Gen Camaro. It's one of the prettiest Camaros ever made. One of the prettiest cars you can get right now, with this, you know, especially when you with the CL1. and It's just kind of very edgy and cool, so I really like it. But why do you have to go ruin it by putting this face on it? I think the big one for me is the bow tie in the bumper. That was a mistake. Um, because what you did, effectively, was you made a sports car look like a new Dodge Ram. And that's not cool. The back of it, however, the back I really like. I think the old taillights were a little sunken in, and they looked good, but they didn't, you know, have that wow factor, you know? And, uh, you know, now they do. They're just kind of real different and bubbly and... I'm not sure any other great descriptive words to use for it, but they look really good. So I like what they did with the back end. The inside looks about the same. Um, it's just the front. I am hung up on the front, man, and not in a good way. Big gripe that I have right now is I feel I just I just <laughs> the same the same complaint I had with the 2018 Mustang. I'm seeing now. You know, the 2018 Mustang when the S550 first came out, I was like, dang, that's a good looking car. And I loved everything about it. I loved it so much I went and bought one. Um, when the 18 came out, I was like, man, you just, you just had to go ruin a good thing for it. You had to take something beautiful and redesign it and make it not as good. It's like the sequel to a good movie. It's like Die Hard. Even though Die Hard 2 was really, really good, and that wasn't a great comparison. You know what I'm talking about. You know when they make a second a sequel to a movie and it's never as good as the original. The, in my mind, the 2018 Mustang is the sequel and it's not anywhere near as good as the 15 to 17 generation. Now, granted, it's growing on me. I like it more now. It's still not as good. Here's where I think the Camaro might be able to redeem itself right here. So right now, because it's fresh, I think I got a little bit of 2018 Mustang in my brain still. So all I am looking at right now is Chevy ruining a good looking car by making it kind of ugly. <coughs> However, once I saw an 18 person, I started to like the front end. Still don't like it more, but I like it now. So what I think is I think people need to maybe calm down. Maybe I need to calm down a little bit too and, uh, and wait to see this car in person because, you know, Based off my experience with the 2018, the car looks so much different in 3D when it's sitting in front of you than it does in just these little stock images that you know these car makers um, give you when they're revealing a car. So I'm gonna hold out hope that they will that it will come together and look good because I hope. My only concern with my hope is that at least the Mustang and the 6th Gen when they both came out were polarizing. You know, at least some loved them and some hated them. But the bad part is this car's not very polarizing. Everybody seems to agree that it's ugly. Um, but like I said, wait to see it in person. Um, you guys let me know your thoughts and uh, what you guys think of this Camaro. You think it's better, you think it's worse. If you think it's better, you're blind. But uh, I'm willing to give it a shot in person. So let me know what you guys think of it in person. And why am I so dang dark? What if I do this? Is that better? Is that better? Can you see me? Okay, this is better. Um, also, give me some guesses on what you think this thing is. You'll find out in a couple days. But most of you guys, I'm sure a lot of you guys know what it is. Um, we just, we're just, we're just JDMing it up in here. So, anyways, let me know what you guys think of this of the uh, the 2019 Camaro. And also, if you guys have anything that you want to uh, to talk about next week, uh, let me know. Let me know, Jake. Literally, like I said, it can be anything. Give me a topic. We'll talk about it next Friday. I love you guys. That's it, man. Bye. That's all I got. See you later.